Today you have the Rhino. I'm drinking a beer. Today's beer is right here. This is from the fourth edition of the Bose Greener Futures Project Phase 3, which is facilitated by the Brew Box. This is Dinosaur Dinosaur Senior. So Dinosaur Senior is the Tyrannosaurus grew it aged in red wine barrels for five months. So there is the bottle for it. Tyrannosaurus grew it aged in red wine barrels for five months. This is 5.8% alcohol by volume. It has organic malt, organic bar, sorry, organic barley malt, local spring water, organic hop, uh, organic beetroot uh, powder, organic spruce tips, organic juniper berries, and organic hibiscus flowers. What? One poutine, three forks. Not that type of people. Like, really? Looks like one person that would share poutine with two other people? Look at me. Is that a, like, was that a subtle joke? You know the camera's recording, right? Mm -hmm. So, the Tyrannosaurus Groot was one of the, uh, Rex? was one of the Groots that I had from them that I really loved. And I had made my review, and my camera screwed up, and I accidentally deleted the review. And I tried everything I could to get the review back, and I could only get five seconds of it back. So I gave up. But now, I get to have it aged in red wine barrels. Um, so, you can see, beautiful beetroot color, that's beautiful reddish color, very hazy. Brownish head, looks really nice. Smells okay. I mean, you get you get that that almost uh, almost borscht scent. Uh, borscht being the uh, Polish beet soup. You get an almost borscht scent uh, mixed with some hibiscus flowers. Mixed with a little bit of that sprucey, uh, sprucey pininess. Smells really nice, and you get a full frontal facelift of, uh, of, like, plum slash, plum slash grape, uh, scents coming from the wine barrels, as well as some nice tannic taste. Well, scents. Put that up here. Give us some drinkage, shall we? Cheerios, good sirs and madams. Oh, that's really nice. That's, uh, just like the original, very soft, very smooth, very easy to drink, light-bodied, very subtle flavors. You get the flowers, you get the spruce, uh, very apparent beet taste. However, now instead of just being the, the sweetness of the beets, which are full of sugar and everything else, instead of just getting the sweetness, you get that tannic taste on the back end. You're getting a little oakiness, a little touch of vanilla, a little bit of that, uh, a little bit of that just red wine. Um, I, I would have expected the red wine barrels to sour it a little bit, but it didn't. It actually uh, tastes really good. Um, really well mixed. Uh, I think that this package is the first time that they may have been listening for once, in that uh, they're just taking a beer, aging it in a barrel, and showing you what that barrel did, instead of taking like seven different beers and seven different barrels and blending them together and hoping for the best. This is, this is actually a great treat compared to the last... Uh, Six no, this is barrel aged beers. You stop eating that poutine, damn it. Um, smells good, tastes good. That second sip, everything the same, but much more vanilla up at the forefront, much more grape up at the forefront. A little bit more tannic, earthy uh, woodiness in the back end. I really do enjoy this. Uh, I loved the original, and I think I love this one more, to be honest with you. Um, out of 10 on this, I'd easily give this a 9. I love this. Anyway, thank you guys for watching. Have a wonderful evening. Au revoir. Abiento. See you soon. Bye-bye. Leave those there to take a picture.